Hello everyone, welcome to this video and today I want to talk to you about how to do shading in Flash. And I already have a video about this, but I'm gonna try out a different technique that I hope is gonna be useful for you. Okay, this is recording, everything good, okay. So, let me start. Okay, let's start with easy stuff, like for example, let's say that I do a circle like this, right? And I want to... I want the circle to have shadows and lights and to look 3D basically. So what I can do is I can click in the in the circle, right? And then I go to to here to the color and here you will have solid color. Well now I want to change it to radial gradient in this example. Like for other examples we might use linear, but for this one I'm gonna use radial gradient because it's like a circle like this. Okay, so let's say that, for example, I want it to be a blue circle. I'm going to choose this color, and then I'm going to choose like a lighter blue like this, okay? So now, as you can see, we have this. But how do we make it so it looks like three-dimensional better? I'm going to teach you right now, okay? So, here you can go to this tool. And normally, I think you will have this tool, the, this tool that is the free transform tool. Well, you want to click and hold the click and choose this gradient transform tool. So what it's going to do is it's going to allow you to transform the gradient that you did. As you can see, so now we can like make it smaller or, or bigger. So for example, like I want to put it here. As you can see, it has more like a 3D. Well, let's, let's put it over here better. Right? So this way we can make like a 3D effect. Well, you have to play with it a little bit to see what size you want it. So for example, that way we can have like a 3D effect. And we also can erase the border if we want to. So it looks better like this. And yeah, that looks cool. So let's do let's say for example that we are doing a drawing and let's say that we have like an arm right so here's the arm this is gonna be a little bit sketchy as you can see but it doesn't matter so now let's say that i fill it in with this color right so now we can go here and select like linear gradient and okay, we already have these colors, these two colors. So now I want to use the same tool to modify this gradient here and put it this way. So it looks like it has a shadow under here, as you can see. So yeah, that's pretty much like the tip. That's all there is to it. It's not too complicated. It's basically very easy so if you like this video like check out the other videos in my channel because i have a lot of flash tutorials and also photoshop so if you're learning both those things you can go and check them out so yeah thank you for watching and see you on the next one